Pleasure to be here with uh, all of you this morning. I first want to thank uh, City Council President Jack Young for being here, uh, Councilman Brandon Scott, Councilwoman uh, Helen Holton, Councilwoman Sharon Middleton, Councilwoman uh, Ricky Spector, Councilman Carl Stokes is uh, making his way. Um, I also want to thank uh, the many uh, members of the union and uh, organized labor who are with us as well. So thank you for joining me to celebrate another step forward as uh, we strive to grow Baltimore by 10,000 families over the next 10 years. We're joined by our partners from Wells Fargo Bank, NeighborWorks America, Neighborhood Housing Services of Baltimore, uh, all of whom are uh, joined with us as we announce an outstanding partnership uh, called the Wells Fargo City Lift Home Ownership Incentive Program. The Wells Fargo City Lift Program will provide $4.5 million in down payment and in closing assistance to potential homeowners in Baltimore. <laughs> this program will aid 300 families in, with $15,000 in assistance to buy a home in Baltimore City. And for that, I say thank you very much. City Lift creates new opportunities for families and will support growth in our neighborhoods. And I want to thank all of our partners who are here today. Uh, Andy Bertamini, Reg Regional President of Wells Fargo Bank, and an incredible partner to have. Uh, <laughs> Deborah Boatwright, uh, Northeast Regional Director for NeighborWorks America. <laughs> Dan Ellis, Executive Director of Neighborhood Housing Services of Baltimore. And Bert Hash, the president of MeQ. Thank you. Uh, thank you all for bringing the Wells Fargo City Lift Program to Baltimore City. I also want to acknowledge the many uh, individuals in uh, my administration that have been helpful in making this happen. Uh, they work to uh, develop market-based solutions to remove blight and connect families with uh, wonderful homes in great neighborhoods. Our housing commissioner, Paul Graziano. Thank you. Deputy Commissioner Ken Strong is here somewhere. I want to, I want to thank Councilman Jim Kraft for being here with us today. Uh, Michael Guy, Director of the Office of Home Ownership, has been helpful, as well as Deborah Moore Carter. Where's Deborah? I know Deborah's around here somewhere. There you are, hiding in the background. Julie Day helps out occasionally. Thank you very much. You're playing the role of Braverman today. Uh, <laughs> Steve Gondel from Live Baltimore, Mark Sisman from Healthy Neighborhoods, representatives from the Maryland Department of Housing and Community Development, representatives of the HUD Certified Housing Counselor Agencies. They've played an incredibly important role in uh, the supportive role in the Wells Fargo City Lift Program, as well as uh, this, our uh, city employees and uh, community stakeholders who are here. I want to thank each and every one of you for your commitment to, your, to our city and for working so hard to make this a, uh, an incentive program that really speaks to the needs of Baltimore. Baltimore excuse me. <laughs> so when Wells Fargo uh, Bank first approached the city about this partnership, we were very, very excited. However, in, others, uh, in other <coughs> cities, uh, the City Lift program was launched with a major event, usually at a convention center. Something like that takes months uh, to organize. We didn't want to wait months. I, I don't think any of us feel that we have months to wait. Uh, we wanted to get moving right away, and here we are. The Wells Fargo has agreed to allocate $1 million for the first three months of the City Lift program, as well as uh, so eligible families don't have to wait. They can apply today. Our partners... <laughs> Our partners will explain how to do that shortly. We're still going to plan a big you know, event at the convention center, and it'll be April 5th and 6th, uh, where many families can come and learn about the program. 
Another request we made is that the City Lift program allow city, state, and community-based home ownership incentives to be used to complement Wells Fargo's $15,000 incentive. The combination and the layering of these incentives will help focus these home ownership opportunities and support important initiatives that we already have going on in the city, such as Vacants to Value, Baltimore uh, City Employee Home Ownership Programs, as well as Healthy Neighborhoods. It's so important that we uh, decided not to work in silos. We're so much better and we can get so much more when we work together and figure out how to layer and how to complement the work because it really uh, works to provide the incentives as we intend. Focusing our resources as opposed to spreading them thin across the city will result in stronger communities and it's a sustainable model. Uh, and now before I turn it over to Andy, I want to end where I began which is 2013 promised to be the best year ever to buy a home in Baltimore City. We have great values in beautiful neighborhoods. We have historically low interest rates for mortgages, and thanks to Vacants to Value initiatives, we have fabulous renovated homes in Baltimore with strong markets like those in our healthy neighborhoods, and I want to thank those partners as well. We have an array of city, state, and community-based incentives already available to, uh, to homeowners. And last year, we were at an event where a woman bragged about bringing home, uh, bringing over $40,000 to the table in incentives uh, when she purchased her home. Uh, she, uh, she was uh, raised from a mother who, uh, from a culture that, uh, that wasn't a, you know, it wasn't a democracy. So when her mother heard of all of the incentives, um, she was incredibly suspicious and told her, don't get her hopes up, because when she got to the table, she didn't believe that those incentives were going to, to be there. Um, but, but when she presented her mother with the keys, she was able to convince her mother uh, that things can be different in, in our country and certainly in Baltimore. So I'm very, very proud of the way that, that we have already uh, have a track record of being able to combine these incentives to provide uh, a real uh, door, a real pathway to home ownership for so many. And, I'm really pleased that with this work, uh, we will be able to continue. Uh, we have uh, the enthusiastic uh, cheerleading and information programs that are available through Live Baltimore. Thank you very much. Keep up the good work. And now, on top of all of those things, we have the Wells Fargo City Lift program offering tremendous incentives for families to become homeowners for the first time or to move up within the city or to relocate to the city. These, uh, the new homeowners will help us uh, sustain and will help us grow the population of Baltimore uh, for our greater good. So thank you for everyone who had a hand in making this possible. And now I would like to bring up uh, from Wells Fargo, Andy Bertamini. Thank you so much, Madam Mayor. And uh, it is such a pleasure to be here today. I'm so excited. As mentioned, my name is Andy Bertamini. I am the regional president for Wells Fargo here in Maryland. You know, Wells Fargo cares about the communities we serve. We are focused on helping Baltimore become more successful <coughs> and supporting Mayor Rawlings Blake's initiative to increase Baltimore households by 10,000 in 10 years. Wells Fargo is also America's largest mortgage lender. We generate approximately one of every three mortgages in the nation. As one of the nation's largest community banks, we feel a commitment to serve the communities we operate and similar to many communities across the country, we have seen how our community, Baltimore, has been deeply affected by the economy. That's why we're committing to do even more here in Baltimore. The City Lift program, which is modeled after our program Neighborhood Lift, is designed to promote home ownership in struggling neighborhoods, which includes providing down payment assistance, home buyer education, and home buyer support. City Lift and its predecessor Neighborhood Lift programs are the first of their kind in the banking industry. Through both programs, Wells Fargo will bring more than $170 million of down payment assistance, housing counselor support, local grants, as well as home buyer support and education to 20 cities in need of help across the country. Baltimore is the 16th city in the nation to participate. Now, Wells Fargo, we know that in spite of low interest rates, saving up the down payment can be the biggest barrier to home ownership 
for hardworking families. Down payment assistance of $15,000 makes home ownership immediately more available and more affordable. It makes a difference in the amount of the borrower's monthly payment. Our $4.5 million commitment to the city of Baltimore paves the way here for 300 new homeowners. Our national partner, NeighborWorks America, through their extensive network of local affiliates here in Baltimore, Neighborhood Housing Services, assures that the funds are administered locally in every community by trusted nonprofit organizations, and that every homeowner coming through City Lift is a prepared homeowner. We look forward to our Baltimore City Lift having the same success, no, actually having more success than many of our prior cities. It is an honor to be here today, and thank you, Madam Mayor. Thank you. Now I'd like to bring to the podium Ms. Uh, Boatwright from NeighborWorks America. Thank you very much. Thank you. It's a great day here in Baltimore. I want to thank Mayor Rawlins, uh, Blake, and Wells, Maryland President um, Bernamini. Thank you so much. Wells Fargo has been a tremendous partner, as well as um, all of the folks here in Baltimore. NeighborWorks is so proud to be a part of this incredible opportunity for people who are interested in buying homes in the great city of Baltimore. Achieving successful home ownership is not just about qualifying for a mortgage and finding a dream home. It's also about knowing how to navigate the home buying process, what to expect once you become a homeowner, and having a trusted advisor to turn to when questions come up. And that's where NeighborWorks America comes in. NeighborWorks America is a national nonprofit organization established by Congress. We've helped people to achieve long-term, sustainable home ownership for the past 35 years. And we do this through our network of nonprofit affiliates in all 50 states, of which NHS, NHS of Baltimore is one of them. They who qualify, individuals who qualify for quality home ownership education according to national standards and who facilitate access to affordable loan products and programs. These are our network of 236 organizations across the country. Well Fargo knows that a prepared home ownership is a successful home ownership, and that successful home ownership builds secure neighborhoods and revitalized communities, and that's our shared goal. We've worked with Wells Fargo to bring lift to cities throughout the country over the last year, and the excitement lift generates at each stop has been extraordinary, and I've had a great time in working with your team of people at Wells Fargo. That is because of the involvement of local elected officials and local partners. So again, thank you, Mayor Rollins Blake and the Baltimore City Department of Housing and Community Development for bringing City Lift to Baltimore and for making this special opportunity right now at the start of a new year to do home ownership right. $15,000 down payment makes a big difference. Yes. And if you're ready to close on your home in the next few months, your monthly payment has just gotten significantly lower. Mm -hmm. You will have more money to put aside to maintain and improve your new home. And if buying a home is your goal for 2013, you can start by signing up for the eight hour home ownership education class so that you can start the path to home ownership the right way and begin to qualify for the $15,000 down payment assistance. You do not have to live in Baltimore now to take advantage of city lift, but you do need to purchase within the city limits. And buying in the city of Baltimore makes sense. It's a great city with a great future. Yeah. A city that is truly investing in its neighborhoods and you can definitely be part of it. So here, with the Baltimore City Lift Down Payment Grant, will be administered by our local NeighborWorks affiliate, NHS of Baltimore, and Dan Ellis, Executive Director, is here to tell you all about it. Thank you, Dan. Thank you. I'd like to begin by thanking Mayor Rawlings Blake for her tremendous leadership in setting the goal that housing matters in Baltimore. 
and that we, we are a city that has a tremendous opportunity and potential to grow. So we're proud of that. We're proud to be a partner with Baltimore City in that, and thank you for your leadership. I also want to thank Andy Bertamini and the team at Wells Fargo for putting together such an innovative program and for investing resources in our city. It is, it, is the, it is one of the best programs that I have seen put together. And thank you for providing the leadership here in Maryland. And thank you to your team nationally for having the, for having the insight and the willingness to invest in Baltimore. Thank you. And I'd like to thank Deborah Boatwright and the team at NeighborWorks America for, for providing the support to design a program and to bring it here to Baltimore and for allowing us to be a partner with you in that. Thank you, Deborah. <laughs> NHS has a proud history working in the city of Baltimore since 1974. And during that time, supporting home ownership has been the hallmark of what we are about. And one thing that we've learned in that time is that home ownership can make the difference be between stre to strengthen a neighborhood. So home ownership can make that difference in your neighborhood. We are proud to be a partner in this City Lift program. So a couple of the details about the program that everybody wants to hear. The City Lift program is a $15,000 forgivable loan program. If someone remains in their home for five years, there is no repayment ever. <laughs> the program is for people earning up to 120% of the area median income, which for a family of four in Baltimore is $102,700, which means it is accessible for many of our current and future residents in Baltimore. In order to qualify for the program, it is required that you participate in an eight-hour ho eight housing counseling program. Housing counseling prepares you for home ownership and helps you to be successful because Wells Fargo believes in and NeighborWorks believes in preparing people for success in home ownership. So working with any HUD certified housing counseling agency in Baltimore will, is a requirement of the program. You also need to work through a participating lender for this program. The loan can come through a number of institutions, but they need to be a participating partner in the program. And for those of you who have a house under contract in Baltimore and may have interest in the program, go to our website at www.nhsbaltimore.org and receive all of the information about the program and to qualify, to see if you qualify to schedule an eligibility appointment. So in order to participate in this program, you schedule an appointment through our website. Again, that address is www.nhsbaltimore.org and schedule a time with us to come see us and determine if you're eligible for this program. For many people who have dreamed of owning a home in Baltimore, City Lift provides the vehicle to make that dream a reality. And so we invite you all to come and join us in this journey of home ownership. Please visit our website at www.nhsbaltimore.org to learn more. Thank you all. Thank you, Mayor, for your leadership. And we appreciate your commitment to Baltimore. Thank, Thank you. you. Again, uh, thank you all for coming. I want to thank uh, Senator McFadden for being here. I know that I saw uh, Gail here on behalf of uh, um, Councilwoman Holton, and I'm saving the best for last. I know you think I'm, I'd look right at you and forgot to introduce uh, our, our comptroller. So if any of you ever wonder if taking cold medicine impacts your, your uh, work performance, it does. So I, I apologize, but I saved the best for last. Thank so thank you for being here. So any questions on uh, housing program? We'll do those first and then we'll allow, not you, Ricky, from the, from the, from the press and then um, we'll, we'll break up and then we'll do um, off-topic to, off questions. Can you tell us what neighborhoods we're talking about? Throughout the city, citywide. I mean, is there a place where we can find out which neighborhood? I mean, people want to know. Well, it's, 
anywhere in the city. Anywhere you can city. buy a house anywhere. in any anywhere neighborhood. In the city. I thought it was targeted. Was, is that targeted? We have other targeted programs, and we made sure that we could use this program with those other ones. So it's not, you know, how you can have a coupon and you can only want, use one at a time. You can use all of them. You can go to Guilford, Rogue Park. You can go anywhere. If you yeah. meet the, the terms, yes. But if you go to a healthy neighborhood, you can use the incentives that are available already through healthy neighborhoods and you can layer on this uh, new $15,000 incentive. What about the people who are reluctant to buy in the city because of ta property taxes? Well, things like these incentives, these incentives that aren't available everywhere, uh, help level the playing field. And uh, that work combined with the work that we're already doing uh, in our efforts to uh, target property tax reduction for homeowners, uh, we're getting there. We're making real progress. And, we, and I intend, and I know my colleagues intend to continue. Thank you.